Hey guys, Iron Phoenix here, back with another video. And if you have ever wondered how to make and merge parts and make your own unique parts in Roblox Studio, then make sure you watch this entire video. So let's get started. So how you start it off is you go and you make two parts. And let's say you want to make a part with a with a hole in the middle. What you do is you scale it to the size you want and then you go over here in model and you turn collisions off. So right now it's on and then you turn it off. And the only way to get them to merge is to use the move tool. And now if you get it down it goes into it because the collisions are off and now what you do is you negate the part that's going to negate off the other part and now you highlight both the parts by either clicking and dragging to highlight both of them or pressing control and clicking and then clicking the other one and then up here saying union and then it creates the part with the hole down on the edge and what if you want to make a house with a window in it well we can just start by making another part and we make it the size we want it and then we make the window cutout part and let's say this is just going to be a 4 by 4 by let's say 8 just so we have some room and then let's go in the move, move tool and then let's push it in there and now we negate this part and then highlight both of them and say union now this part has a hole in the middle now we insert another part the same size as the other part that was in there and now we can put it in the place that that other part was and then we can also go on transparency and set that to 1 or to make it a window something like 0 0.5 and then you have your wall with a window in it and what if you want to what if you want to let's say make a part that has another part attached to it so you could insert a part and then a sphere on top of that part. Well, what if you wanted the sphere to go into this brick? Well, then you just scale it up to the size you want it, and then you can move it into position. And now what you can do is highlight both of them. Don't say negate on all of them, but say union. And now Roblox treats this as one part. And you can keep doing this as much as you want. And if it's not working for you to where you move it and it moves one part, then what you can do is you can say on move, you can turn it th this right here down to one. And then you have that and the other thing up here is for rotate if you want to rotate see all of these are five degrees but what if you set that to ninety degrees then when you want to rotate you have your four ninety degree spots and since it's a circle it doesn't look any different but that's how you do it So. If this video was any help to you and you want to see more Roblox tutorials, remember to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And as always, Iron Phoenix out.